Hi, today I have a product review video for you. I'm going to be reviewing the Bare Essentials Faux Tan Sunless Tanner. Looks like that. I got this bottle from QVC. It's a 16 ounce and it came with this uh, body buffing brush as well. And it was $50, but they also sell a smaller size of it on the QVC website as well as at Bare Essentials and the Bare Essentials website for $22, I believe. But you can only get this brush through a QVC purchase. Okay, so the product comes like this. It's got this big pump on it, and um, it's just a muddy brown color. It has a slight uh, olive tone to it, just very slight though. And it smells, it smells really good actually. It really reminds me of Jurgen's lotion, the original scent, the cherry almond scent that they, it's been around for years and years. My mom's used it forever, and I love the way that stuff smells. So it smells really good. Um, okay, so they recommend, just like with a lot of self-tanners, you know, exfoliate your skin, dry it off, and then apply this. So you're going to pump a little bit of this product onto the brush, and then buff it into your skin in little circular motions and patches, basically. This brush that it comes with is so nice. It is so soft. This is super, super, I don't know if you can tell, it's so dense, and it's really soft, and it's so luxurious just to apply the tanner. It feels great. However... Applying sunless tanner with a product like this is so time-consuming. It takes forever. It is so much quicker just to use your hands or gloves or something. This will probably triple or quadruple the amount of time that you have to spend applying this tanner. That being said, it applies it very, very well. This is a very good product to, to apply. You don't have any um, kind of, you know, blotchy sp spots on your skin. It does a really, really good job. Um... So yeah, but it takes a really long time. So it's just kind of take a long time to tan, but it comes out good. You got to kind of weigh your options there. Okay, so they, um, the company claims that your tan will last about five days. So you need to retan every five days to keep up the same color. I've noticed that the difference between day three tan and the difference between day five tan is quite large you never quite return to your original color within that five day period but there's a large drop off between day three and day five so i actually recommend that you tan every four days with this if you want to keep up the same constant summer glow so you don't really have to worry about you know do i have to change my foundation because i'm so much paler today than i was four days ago stick to four days and you'll be good um after i apply it i notice i, I was applied at night and in the morning it has that that smell, that nasty, rancid, sunless tanner scent comes to me. If I shower, it'll go away and it'll fade and you can cover it up with fragrant lotions, which I often do with a lot of sunless tanners. But it fools you because it smells good when you apply it, but then that scent definitely comes back. So I don't want you to think this is one of those like miracle sunless tanners that never smells bad because it can smell bad. Okay, so I have really dry skin. And I was worried about using this just like I do with a lot of tanner products to see if it would dry out my skin more or if um, I just it would kind of like irritate my skin. But it's surprisingly moisturizing. I don't know how they do it, but it is. I apply lotion the next morning after I use it and it's fine. My skin doesn't really react to that, that dryness or anything. So that's actually really good. I would definitely repurchase this product. I really like it. I like the scent when you apply it. I think this brush feels really, really good and it does a really good job evening out the tan as it applies. And while it is $50, which is a lot for a tanner, it lasts pretty good. I've been using this for about a month, I think, maybe a little bit more than a month, and I'm just like down to here. And my sister's been using it too. So it lasts pretty good. Uh, you'll feel like you're applying a lot of product so many times that you pump. I do about half a pump and do like a section of my skin at a time. And that seems to kind of help me control it and keep it where it needs to go. Okay, I hope this review was helpful for anybody who is interested in buying a sunless tanner. Or if you're just interested in the faux tan line by Bare Essentials. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.